Hello, this is Cheryl for Compass for Your Life. Mark and I took a trip up to the sand hills of Nebraska to see the Halsey Forest, and we just thought we'd share some of our videos with you. This is in the little town of Myrna. Uh, it's on the way up from where we live to the Halsey Forest, and I think it's just kind of a little bit of an ad for the company, um, but we thought they were fun, so we stopped and took a video. And you can see it was pretty windy, so they were running pretty good. This is actually some pictures of the sand hills. Um, the sand hills cover about a quarter of Nebraska, uh, 19,600 square miles, give or take. Um, but these are actually sand dunes. I know they don't look like it, but they are. They're covered with grass. Um, you can see here, this is just a kind of a close-up of what the ground looks like without the grass covering it. Um, it's considered a national natural landmark, and it's very beautiful. Um, this is Halsey Forest, the entrance to the Halsey Forest. Uh, um, this actually is the only hand-planted forest in the world, and hand-planted, guys. Uh, this is uh, the Ranger and Nursery. It's named after the gentleman who wrote a letter to Theodore Roosevelt, and convinced him that this was a worthwhile project. So in 1902, the Halsey Forest was born, and the Bessie Nursery is actually the oldest federal tree nursery. Um, here's some pictures of some of the seedlings being watered. They can raise up to 4.5 million seedlings of conifer and hardwood bearwoods a year. And uh, it's really quite a a uh, sight to see all of these trees being grown. They use them for the forest because uh, sometimes the trees don't regenerate it, but this is also sent to farmers and landowners. Okay, in Halsey Forest today. Yeah, I'm sure I take a road trip up here. Um, actually, we're in Nebraska. It does not look like Nebraska, but actually, um, the, we're on the bridge over the Middle Loop River. Um, I'm going to show you what it looks like. There are um, Three loop rivers. This is the middle. There is the south and the north. Um, but this one happens to be the middle. Um, there's a road that actually goes into the forest. So, um, yeah, and then if you keep down this bridge, uh, there's a place to fish and uh, all kinds of recreational things to do in this forest. So, so um, we're heading to the, the tower next. Okay, this is, we're still in Halsey Forest. Uh, this is one of the places where you can actually go out and fish. You've got a place to clean your fish after you catch them. Um, but actually benches and everything else is to fish. Um, real nice area. Actually, it's a beautiful area here today. Um, pine trees around there. And um, so if you're into fishing, that's one thing they got here. Well, we stopped to take uh, pictures of this because of Smokey the Bear. And you have Smokey the Bear when you have a forest, so it's actually a forest. Um, this is Scott Lookout Tower, which is named after one of the supervisors of the rangers in the initial um, setup for the towers and things. Uh, this one's the only one actually still being used on occasion in the state of Nebraska. It's 50 feet up in the air, um, so it's quite the spectacular view when you get up there. Um, this is when we got started um, on the way up, Mark saying hi. Uh, this is quite uh, the climb. Um, so if you're afraid of heights, maybe it's not the best thing to try. Um, you do have handrails, so they're very, very sturdy. This actually is kind of a picture partway. And you can see the sand hills there, and you can sort of get an idea of just how vast the land area really is of the sand hills. Um, you can see some of the trees here. This is from the top of the tower. I didn't go up because uh, there were bees up there. and um, Bees, whether you look at it one way or the other, they don't like me or I don't like them. Um, but Mark's kind of showing you what it looks like from up on the top. Um, some of the trees there. And it's kind of the road and things that lead up to this area. But here again, oh, there go the bees. Um, here are some of the pictures of the trees that have been planted. Um, there are 22,000 acres of trees, and these were all hand planted, so th that was 
pretty big project, but you can really see it's a spectacular view from up above on the tower there. Mark was just showing you to where, how far it up it, the tower actually is. Here again is the sand hills and he's panning back over the forest to kind of show you how many trees there truly are. And he's showing you how far down it is. Uh, it is kind of uh, disconcerting. So if you do, like I say, have problems with heights, this is something you might want to think twice about. But it was definitely worth the view. And just wonderful, uh, wide open spaces. Again, here's some of the sand hills. It just goes on for, for miles. This is actually in the town of Halsey. Um, that's about all there is there. Uh, there's a convenience store, which is very well stocked. So if you have any kind of needs, they can kind of take care of you. I hope you enjoyed our trip to the Halsey Forest.